Yes, greetings, greetings, one and all. Yes, as we come again on the session of questions and answers. Saturday evening, last week, I think last week we come, um, or was it last week or the week before, we come Saturday morning. But we die this evening, I will come in, just come in after the, the juggling. And since we come in and we don't really have nothing to do right now, we say, all right, we could just jump on because you know the knowledge I will teach non stop. As you know, Babylon deceive non stop. So I have to teach righteousness non stop. I know we always say we don't know everything, you know, but the few things that we know will suffice to help those who really want to get help. We have our testimony with tumors and bleeding. We have your testimonies with um, pain relieving, testimony with blood pressure, with diabetes. And those are the people who actually seriously want to get better. The ones them who can't help themselves, we fix them up. And once them take the herbs, it's not like we're hoxing if they will be good. We know. Seeing that it has done over and over and over and over, we know that, yeah, once they start take the herbs, yes. Bless up yourself, is it, um, Carita a carrot. Bless yourself. Once you start the herbs, <clears throat> we know if you have fuck that life begins to generate. Once you start eat right, yes, things will fit into place so we intrigue people all the while just to make sure you eat right and take your herbs and your health issues will little by little disappear if you not do that then trust me. Problems after problems after problems after problems. Yes. We ask you to tap in your likes and we ask you to follow the horse. Yes, please follow the horse. That's anytime we come on, you know. I don't know if there's a subscription section there, but if it is, then you can subscribe. That's what I heard. I'm not sure. But we ask you to follow the host and also tap the likes and share the life. The world is getting vicious. More evil is appearing by the day, and human is in peril. So much things happening in so much cases. Whole heap of things are come one ago. Yes, yeah man, share the life, share the life, share the life with your family, your friends, your enemies. Please share the life. Ask us to follow the horse. Tap in the likes. Very important to do these things. And since this life 
It's about questions and answers. Some of you already write down, not, not change. Jocelyn, blessing, love, give thanks. For some who just are coming on the first time, you know that you just write down. Judith, bless up yourself. Miss Messam, what are you doing? Mm -hmm. Our duty is to make sure that you can, if you really want, and determine to stay healthy your will. Question Your aunt of fibroids, I should think, and it turned cancer. Doctor remove it. She went on chemo and now liquid on her lungs. Liquid on her lungs. Well, she will need to take something to clear that. Bitter wood. Since she do chemo, bitter wood is a good plan to clear the lungs of any unwanted liquid. Uh, so you can get the foreign dandelion root. You can get that from the health food store. Dandelion root, you can get it from the health food store. Bitter wood, you can get it from the market. At the health food store, sell bitter wood too. Yes. And since you do this tremor, a good food is Irish marsh. Irish marsh is a chelation formula. It chisel out every metal out of the body. Also, rice bitters arrest cancer cells. So rice bitters is good. One, I will be write it in, um, is it Bob, Bobbit or... Babin Tracy, something on the side. She must feed an um, Irish marsh. Very important, she do. Since that plant arrests all them cancer cells. Feed on it, just feed on it. Bitter wood is a good food for any form of chimop. Therapy patient to rice bitters arrest them dead cells, boost by the immune system. Yes, those three things is good, so she can use those to help the body. So that's bitter wood, rice bitters, and um, Irish marsh. All right, Tracy, get to work and save mommy. And I hope she not have to go back on the knife again. You are New Year. Welcome, Miss Buckley. Welcome. You are good. Give thanks to her. Yes, stop in the likes. So stop in the likes. I'm going to ask you to share the live. We're asking you to share the live. Share the live. Tap in the likes. And we're asking you to follow the oars all right so you know the quest the session is about questions and answers what is good to reverse diabetes your dad diagnosed with it three months ago that means hey, maybe about six years or seven now and just want to find out you can get on your shame you can get neem and rice bitters to make tea to drink. Neem and rice bitters put together to make tea. You have to write them down. That's when you have to repeat yourself. So you have book, I have pen. Book, pen. Neem and rice bitters. Put them together and make tea. Cowich and sorosy. Put them together and make tea. Cascara bark for the digestive system. You get 70 grams of it. You take a tablespoon, put it in your pot. Two cups of water you put on it and boil it down to one cup. So you need one cup in the morning and one before bed. 
him now have to take them, all of them, on the same day. Take them on different, different days. So, neem, rice bitters, tea, three cups per day. Cowich and sorosy tea, three cups per day. And the two cups of the cascara bark. You get the cascara bark at health food stores. Those can help the diabetes. Tell them to eat right and stop eating the diabetes food. <laughs> Lad, how works is that question? The name of um, Ijan, Ijani. Is it Ensley? What a question to ask. Can a person eat healthy in a foreign country? Yes, I can. Yes. Don't care how much evil upon the planet. There's always a good side. You just have to find it. You just have to find it. A blessing, Baba. You just have to find it. And you can find it. You know? It is this determination that lets you find it. A blessing. Work my mommy then. Irish marsh has all the mineral content that the body need. At least 92 minerals it stores. So you definitely have to just feed on it. Don't come off. You can't take it for a whole year and beyond. You see, that's why we tell you for right. Because you have to pay attention. We don't like to repeat. Repeat slow along the progress of life. Unless you have program your mind. So you have to pay attention, focus and write. Book and pen. Book and pen. Once you come to this session, I always come with your book and your pen. I always come with your book and your pen. Once you come to this session of question and answer, I always come with your book and your pen. And you have to write. You have to write. Diabetes is neem. Rice bitters. Cowich where we call stinging nettle and surrogacy and cascara bark. There are formulas, they are different. Neem, as we said, neem and rice bitters put together to make tea as one formula. Then surrogacy and cowich put together to make tea one formula. Cascara bark by itself another formula. So all the diabetes people. Neem, rice bitters put together make tea. Three cups up per day. Sorosi, cowich put together tea. Three cups per day. The cascara bark, what you get at the health food stores, you take a tablespoon, put it in your pot, write it down. One tablespoon of the cascara bark, put it in your pot. Two cup of water upon it and boil it to a cup. So you need two cups per day, one in the morning, one before bed. That's it for the diabetic people. I wanna have me I'm good. If you don't eat good, problem. I'm not supposed to drink cold water and I'm there I tell people so I can drink cold stuff. I'm gonna drink a little bit liquid when I come in here and thirsty and the whole body just feel not so good. Sometimes we know the things them and still go miss the and things that we are going to escape when I escape. As I was saying the world now give us some likes just stop your phone let me just tap my phone and we ask you to follow the horse. We have a whole heap of I think 42 videos up there talking about um talking about our herbs herbs you can actually see the plants and also the literature of the plant that you understand it pretty much well yes yeah, so give us some likes and we ask you to follow the host follow, follow the page listen to the videos them very intriguing very important and you can learn a few things about the plants that were sometimes you may see in, see in your backyard you not know, even know say the good you know much people tell about um, this plant we call um, Lycopus virginicus, which is bugle wheel. 
I want to show people, look at people, say, but it's in my yard. It's nothing in my yard. There you go. You never know, say, good. You learn it on this life. So, get on board. Get on board and make sure that you learn about these plants and what they are good for. And once you can incorporate them in your dietary regime, now, if you're busy and you can't fix yourself, we make these herbal products and we sell them. Like we have a huge package. Some of, some of our products, some. Some of these nice products that we use to heal people, very, very important products, very important herbal products. That little finish, like it, the little finish. Why did I think that I still have it here? A few of these. That we used to heal people overall. We were talking about this last night, the intellect capsule one. So I mean, so that we did do a lot. I, I, B. What else we have in here? I was supposed to have um, three capsules. We have about six different capsules that we use so far. Motor. The motor is that thing will go very fast. It's not tarry as it comes done. It's so powerful as people buy it, them buy it too. We have four powerful capsules right here. Just to show us some products that we use to heal. Basically, tree sickness. Because it's only tree sickness in your body. Not 10 or 50 or 100. Only tree sickness in your body. Trust me. So I will show you how we set up a package we ship off. Yes. Now this is paniculata tea. All of this is one month supply. This tea we use it to clean lymphatic issues. 
toward a fibroid and breast cancer. And as you know, these things target the lymphatic system. And so this is a circulatory plant, a lymphatic plant, an immune plant, and a nerves plant. The formula is created with herbs, more than one. I will get some beautiful results. Boots in your immunological system. When I say boots, I mean boots it. But before we could re you reach to the immunological system, we use this. This is the base of your body. We use this to clean the plaque out. We can't go your digestive system if we if we if we, uh, we can't go your immune system if we don't reach to your digestive system. Your digestive system control at least eighty five percent of your immunological system. So when we found out that data going why we need to get the result in at the beginning, the initial state of our premise. We find out we have to create something to clean the digestive system. And this comes into being. And that is how we start get the results. The 9 OC1 pulled from as far as the brain right down to your abdominal cavity. It clean head, cranium, thoracic, and abdominal cavity. When that cleaning starts taking place, we use the paniculata tea to power up the immune system, power it up, like literally power up your body. You can start to feel cool in yourself. Because it run down the cancer cells, then, which is the dead tissues. When we say three things alone are sick with it, is mucus. Same thing with your blood, you know, thing where you can spit out. We call that coal in Jamaica. Foreign call it mucus. The next one is parasites. This deals with parasites and kill them. Likewise, we use this also to aid the 9 C, what we call ISAP. So look, ISAP is a neural plant, a brain plant. So if parasite in the brain, it start kill them from up there coming down. But it work on a GI tract. The ISAP officiality works on a GI tract. Right down to your anus. It clean. Just as your David said, cleanse me with ISAP and I will be whole. So we start with that program, the cleaning process, boots in the immune system. Then we use what we call the, the quassia. The quassia, this is this one. This deal with colony, like mosquito when them bite you or have something mess up your blood and it live there. The quassia kill parasites also. But it ward off and kill viruses. Name them. AIDS, syphilis, gonorrhea, herpes, trichomonasis, bacteria, vagitosis. I'll be, uh, what I'm call um, the parasitic virus, trichomonasis, yes. Which is a, a, actually a parasite. Candida albicans also. We use the quassia to clean it. And the quassia give, I think, about 6-8 of its mineral content to the skin so it keep the skin good. If you're malnutritious or anorexia and some people where them them system locked down and them can't eat, it open up the grilling, which is the hunger hormone, and make sure so you eat and your life get back better. So we, we've been cleaning. We've been cleaning. This also is a hemoglobin formula. It transport um, hemoglobin blood from your lung pipe to your your, your um, with the system in your body name again, man. Your mitochondria, which is an electrical bank in your body. It take the blood out there, circle it, and make it reach down in your mitochondria. So that is what. We show you so far doing our still continue. Lily of the Valley, what we always talk about, Lily of the Valley, it works right here to bring the unwanted mucus out. It and another plant we call the stinging nettle. Work right here. Alzheimer's, you know, memory problems, sinusitis, allergies, it bring it down. Carry it down, carry it down off. 
when you what them call it S um Estesian don't know if I pronounce it right but that is the um the connection with your ears, your eyes, your nose and your throat. For all the people who have your titinous or ringing in the ears or what, whatever going on with the the um the decibel in your ears or the auditory canal. Whatever people have them problems in nowadays. We use the lily of the valley upstairs also. But it's a package we have put together, you know. Then because the nerves always damage. Every time a human being sick, the nerves get damaged. We use the verb in a mix. It's a mix to strengthen up the nerves, power up the nerves, power up the nerves, get the nerves powerful again. That's what we use the verb in a mix to do. Two plants. Then when the nerves powering up, we want to electrify the body with energy. Power up the body with energy. Then we come in with the iron tea. There is a couple of plants in this with iron plant. Energy, energy, energy. Keep it going. Adrenal because it goes right on the adrenal gland, right on the kidneys. You know them adrenal glands sit on the kidneys. And since the, 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 the adrenal glands is in the endocrine system, we activate the endocrine system. So when we do endocrinology, we know exactly what we're doing. We power up the gut system, which is the endocrine system, where the woman over them sit and the man prostate gland sit, and that is the same place where the pancreatic gland sit. So we fire up the body with the iron right there. Then we come in with what we call them anamu. Anamu. Guinean weed. The Guinean weed mix. And we target the thymus gland, also the bone marrow. The bone itself and the marrow. Now, that is a cleaning section. The building is the iron part. This capsule we call regenerator, fight out virus. You know, take down the spike protein, stop the cytokine storm, build the body, ward off the invaders, you know, balance up your blood pressure. This is the regenerator. We use to balance up the blood pressure. This is a huge package. We're also going again with the IIB capsule to refine the circulatory system, the whole vascular, vascular system. These are the capsule section of it. And then we speak about the motor, which is the nerves regenerator, also C5, C6, 11, 12. This, that is a spinal cord, which is a second brain. You have four brain in your body. This upper side of your spinal cord is two. So we use the motor to power up the central nervous system, power up and reconstruct it, kill out pain and discomfort. Now the last one we have. So then basically done. Them not sit down and tell them come on people find out so we have them boom, and gone. So that's the motor. Now the intellect is what we use for the skeleton system. That is the osseous system, the bone works. That clarify the brain, the marrow, the blood vessel. Make your brain function good water off memory loss, Alzheimer's, things like um sinusitis, allergies things of that nature. The, the intellect, the intellect which is this one, is a very powerful formula. Eye problems, um, teeth, nerves problems, your, your teeth, when your teeth are damaged, it stops the decaying of the teeth. We talk about that all the while because of the calcium fluoride content. Also, iodine, thyroid issues. I remember we use the Anamo, which is a thymic formula. To target a thymic cell, the thymic cell or the thymus gland is where people loving, caring, compassion, but it connect right to your bone marrow, and the the, the animal also targets Saddam and Gomorrah. When we talk about Saddam and Gomorrah, when I talk about homosexuality, Saddam and Gomorrah original was your lower chakra when it's too active, and your promiscuous, and your dual type of sexual morality. Anamo goes there and halt that fire and calm your nerves and make you get by the passion of Christ 
which is the Christus, the eyelid from the calstrum in your brain. So when you put the intellect up there, it modify and magnify the reality of your mind and you come to yourself. Because now you want to meditate, you want to pray more, you want to get in tune with the Creator. And so that's the whole full package we have right here. I will normally ship to people anywhere in the globe to heal them. And when I ask if they are going to get better, we know. If we ask, then we are not sure. Now we have these two aisles. We use one is Sana and one is Esav. Esav Isle, Sana Isle. We use these two aisles for people who have the um, Eustachian, that's the proper pronunciation. Eustachian problems, that is the Eustachian tube. It's the connection of your ears, your eyes, your nostril, your throat. Eustachian tube is when too much mucus take up your brain and it's filtering in the wrong place as something is pouring up or building up mucus in your head. That is where the intellect always has to come in because it removes any unwantedness from the brain. So we create these two aisles also and we make people just like a tincture drop of both of them and drop them in the mirrors. Also, this one work on pain and discomfort itching and scratch on the skin like lesions or chill beans like scaly skin scaly and and uh, it they perfectly put together we use this one the esav uh, so you can rub the esav on your face to take off spot it is not boop and overnight but this also does the same thing the 901 beautify the skin and make it look radiant that's the reality that was not even my experience. That was the experience from clients. I said, boy, this thing I really take a spot off a body. That's what the 9OC does. And um, the aisle now, for people who have an athlete foot, or if you have genitalia sore, we use the ESA. For people who have sore upon them, penis or sore upon them, um, vagina, we like herpes or you know anything we have to do with um gonna raya in one of them sword we use the east of isle well to be honest all this east of isle created is because i picked up acid and my genitalia a couple years ago i think that was way back in um 2016 i had sex back then when i was having sex but you may not use condom and within two days i say i look like a little sore so when we asked the doctor, we realized it was not an infection. It was them sodas. We look at soda, 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 and the bad food. She wasn't, she never having a virus, and the bad food, and it burned me up. So, but sometimes I wonder if I get them experience of a create powerful thing. So I go to check and realize what can repair menalin, or menalin, or carbon, which is what you call your, your color code and unite back your color with itself and this I'll come into being so we start check the plant them I want to check the plant them we extract it one ear straight oh god it when you rub it on your face make your face nice rub it in my ear all over my body yes but it's a is a continuous thing and we rub the east of eye which is this eye we rub it upon the genitalia now this this version of fully power this song will go in a couple months I still have a buckle when I have to fly one ear when it reach one ear but even at this stage couple months it's still effective when we rub it on within two weeks the, the carbon the color of your skin come right back for people who bleach and when them bleach and them them face don't look good anymore and them, them want to reunite the completeness of them, them skin, them by the east of Isle. And then just rub it on daily. Just rub it on daily upon them face. Rub it on daily. For at least uh, three, four months. Just rub it on daily upon them face. Rub it on daily. Daily. Rub it in the skin like when they would use a scrub. And it will bring back the color code, the carbon. That is all powerful. And I'm sure I feel them, you know. But me see how them work. I see the marvelous things 
what they have done to humans. So when people tell us our data going with them body, we say, hey, our data going with them body. You know, most of them things are so powerful. Because sometimes you make some things, you know, from the spiritual energy you make them, but you deep down don't really know the eye effect where them have until somebody say, yes, I got it, do. You know, so we ask it to me, and I say, yeah, man, I got it, do, doc. You know, I got it, do. So, we just have to show you, say, we have all these products where we use to help people to heal themselves. So those, those are some of our products um, that we use to heal the nation. Yes, I'm in Jamaica, and they work pretty much fine. Give us some likes. Give us some likes. Share the life. And we're also asking you to follow the O's. Follow the O's. So do you understand that we sell these products that we're telling people to take with us we use other plants and we use other plants also to um god we know about 300 plants but we find out so we never need to use 300 we can't use just 25 of them <laughs> to get what we want You want to get pregnant after fibroid surgery. Oh, scar tissue. Well, get the Guinean weed. A vervine and the dog blood. Put them together. The Guinean weed, the vervine, the dog blood. You know, our, um, yes, Guinean weed, vervine, dog blood. You can use those. A handful of each. And you put, um, put it in a five five liter of water and boil it to two and a half liters and those can help you um before a lot of people who face who you call, yes i could finish up the lady before i said that so the guinean weed dark blood vervine put that together and boil them take two cups per day feed up on a lot of irish marsh uh, so you can get bassy the bark for the blood circulation all right and take three cups per day yes eat up a whole of irish marsh it will help the scar tissue yes eat up a whole of irish marsh to replace energy and minerals that has been removed from the operation you have some of women them who dribble like when them finish urinate and also constriction them can't hold them urine. Woman happen at uh, some time when the mouth um run all the water. I can happen when you drink all the cold juice. That that happened to me sometime when I when I drink cold something. Which is like one out of every ten ten years or so. But you know like a bad habit sometimes still catch you every now and then. You don't, the, the habits them do the from your pitney and you try to move them. Yes, so the the intellect for the information, just WhatsApp me for the cost, 354-7875, 354-7875, which is the number. Um, you can call, WhatsApp it better. That's what we can get to talk to more than one person. And you get the information. The intellect, the regenerator, the IIB are some good formulas, some good capsules, sweet. I take the IIB daily just for energy production. To keep the energy going, I maybe take um, 12 per day. You just take four. Yeah, Gaia start. But that's how I take mine. Power me up, you know? So, 
you can check out those products. A blessing, man, a blessing, a blessing, a blessing. I have these products um, exclusive. No one else sell them but me. If you see nobody I sell them, a scammer and a fraud. Dr. Kima alone sell them. Nobody else. Good evening. Brain tumor, get some Guinean weed and mulaka. Guinean weed and mulaka. Those can help you with your brain tumor. Cascara bark for your belly. Clean the belly. Low blood count, blood plan. Sassy perilla, basida bark. Bring up your blood. Sassy perilla, basida bark. And also sorosy for the copper content of your brain. Basida bark, sassy perilla, sorosy. Those can carry up your blood. All praises be unto the most high. Yeah, Rastafari. Yo, you can't stop a god. It's all good. Nothing around. All right. Brown, just send me a WhatsApp and ask for the price of what you want. Swelling of the feet seems like a, a thing I want with swell and clean. I want one. I will help people up them ankle swell up. Get some dandelion, Jamaican dandelion. Also, drink it and get to urinate a lot. You can also get um, vervine. Boil the vervine and make it cool, not cold, cool, and drink it cool. It will increase the volume of the urine for the swelling good on. Put on a sax when you're walking in your cold concrete house before your soul or your foot get messed up. Yes, um, for, for prices, is it correct? Um, 354 78 75 354 78 75 354 78 75 Good evening, is it Millicent? Bless up yourself. So you can WhatsApp me, telegram me, or signal me in one of those places. Um, Ashley, you just, you just call, um, WhatsApp me. You can let me do this, sir. One second. You can just WhatsApp me and we send the prices them. Yeah man, the price is on the intellect, just WhatsApp we and we send you the price. Alright, 354-7875. I want one of the ear Eustachian formula. Yeah. Uh, you want for the um the ear, the throat and the eye. Yeah. Yeah, when um done it. Um we can give you, you can take the, the island there. As I said, so we show you a couple of products. So all these things work. And let me be honest, there ain't no quick fix. You have to eat right while somebody is testing number to see if it's right. Good. You eat right. There ain't no quick fix. It's good you get something for the, the eye them. We tell off use them. To get something for the brain, but always get something for right or something. I in my cast, well not the belly, but what inner the belly I cast the problem. Yes. Skin <laughs> uh, skin motion. Yeah, the east up just call WhatsApp for the um the information. No. Mm, the website is not there. I try make the website and I get scammed. So I call out for that. 100 dollars I just I'll do get back a little piece of it still, which is good. I don't want to fuss and fight. I just easy myself. <laughs> Such is life. So this time when I go create my website, I have to go really know which part of the people I'm located, good answers are that the business them do. 
and how long they might breathe for and them have something for show so that the business they might run and we can say all right but this we now do it again until i am sure but for for um, you just have a call whatsapp me april love just whatsapp me or signal or telegram any one of them i'm in jamaica so just whatsapp me yeah, man. Just WhatsApp me, man, and ask for the information on them. Okay, and give you the price. Pinch nerves. Yeah, we have stuff for pinch nerves. Pinch nerves is belly problem, you know. The digestive system of a clean out. And you start balancing nerves with vervine and rum goat dashalang. But clean up the belly, eat whole lip of Irish marsh and fruits to move that problem. Pinch nerves kind of bend up people, gear strokes. Paralysis, all type of something. Don't play with it. Acid reflux, vervine. Vervine is a zinc and selenium formula. Get it and drink it three cups a day. Get there, you are yeah, burning. So get basida bark for neutralize the acid. Basida bark, that's a gel. In time, boil it kind of jelly. Not slime, God, people say it's slimy. No, it's not slimy, it's jelly. Slime away the pan fish. It's a different. It gel, then call it mucilage and mucilage. Very, very good. It soothes inflammation, burning areas. Yes, and you can also get stinging nettle. I hope you write it down, flowers. Stinging nettle, then call it cowich. Use it, make tea when it dry. And drink three cups. Vervine tea, three cups. And get the basida bark. It's a popular tree. Boil it and drink it, three cups. Take them on different, different days. It will soothe the era. But, as something make your stomach burn, you have to put fried product and highly food and cold stuff. Now follow me. <laughs> yes. Yes, give us some likes now. Just tap up your phone, tap up your phone and give us some likes. We ask you to share the live and we ask you to follow the host. Please follow the host. And go watch all of the video that is there. Our YouTube, you want to can go to our YouTube too and subscribe. Our YouTube, we're going to write it down. Is look alive with Dr. Kimo. One word. But our look alive spell different. That's why we have to write it. We spell L O O K. That's look A. L O O K A L Y F E. That's life. L Y F E. W I T H D R K I M O. We're gonna write it down when we finish. And you can go there and subscribe. We have a whole of video did us at all. Yes, and we YouTube page. Alright, give us some likes, just tap up the phone. We ask you to follow the host. Where in can I find you? I'm in Jamaica here, man. Just send me a WhatsApp. I'm in I'm in um I, I live right here in Jamaica. WhatsApp me for all the information then. Low blood count. I will really answer the one there already. Blessing. Your lady have enlarged fibroids and is to do surgery. Queens, so much are you having this fibroid issue? Did you know that some survey came out that your acrylic or formaldehyde chemical that is in your that they put on your fingernail? And on your toenail and the things that they put on your head having cancer chemicals that turn your body into a living mess a lot of women having breast lump and fibroid but a lot of chemicals that you use constant even when you inhale it i want to put on something over your nose it still come true but your body gets used to it and it is a trillion dollar industry so everybody wants to be a part of that and it's very rewarding financially but in terms of health it is very destructive no i just got to let you know that's the reality so basic life and knowledge not just choice alone but a knowledge and so i see a whole of my queens turning up with fibroid and i know it has to be something that is doing that damage and enough of these cosmetic 
things that you use that you're indulging is damaging you and then you go heat bad make matters worse yes let's get on the guinean weed three cups per day guinean weed dark blood vervine them three plants make sure you get on that Mr. Ezra Sheldon make sure you get on that guinean weed vervine dark blood a handful of each put them in a pot five liters of water and boil it down to two and a half liters make sure you drink three cups one in the morning one afternoon and one in the evening yes those can help her basida bark liquid very good all right husband rug panar nurse problem vervine and ramgut dashalam go on those two plants two powerful nervous plant vervine ramgut dashalam tea three cups per day close to the evening Sarsaparilla is a circulatory plant, three cups per day. Yeah, we don't want to put the number on the screen, guys. As I put it up again, you know, I want to pin it again. So that's why we just tell you what it is. But it's like when you pin it, it nasty. Like if a body cry, you say it pin and it don't move. Now it don't move, same way. Greetings. Anemia is a blood issue. So get the blood plant them. Burdock, yellow dock, sassy pearl, basida bark. Use them for that. Burdock, yellow dock, sassy pearl, basida bark. You can find everything except the basida bark in a health food store. And me, I teach the health food store them about it. So they must don't have it in there now. They are going to need to pay me for do advertisement for them. Because uh, they don't know the plant, they you know. we plant them better than foreign plant, but that be a foreign plant, they might care come. Burdock, yellow duck, sassy pearl, bassy the bag. Get them four plant for the anemia to bring up the blood. Boil all of them together and chung up yourself. Blessings, blessings, blessings. Burning of the chest, bassy the bark, stinging nettle. Those are gel plants. They are astringent formula. Them soothe inflammatory ailments. Stinging nettle tea. While the basida bark by itself strong, three cups per day. Two months, three months. Them two there, you get rid of it. Don't look for any quick fix while you're doing it. No fry product, no fry food. No fry products, no fry food. No oil food, no alcohol, nothing cold. Eat or drink. All right, burning. Get to work. Sassy pearl, bassy the bark, burdock, yellow duck. Those are blood plant. Buy one of my oil for people who the swollen ankle. Buy the Isab oil. I can buy two. The east of Isle, you can buy two for the swollen ankle people. Yes, that's what we created for, and many more things as far as chill beans and lesions. All right? Well, if you don't want to have to do the surgery, get to work. Yeah, that's the number right here 354 7875. You have to get to work. Get to the formulas, we just give out. The Guinean, dark blood, vervine, three cups per day, and makes you stop eat the firebird food. And now the cosmetic world for a little bit. <laughs> I'm just saying, guys, y'all don't know it's messing you up, but it is. What you can take for seizure, vervine is good for seizure. Make the cup of tea and drink them. But clean up right here. In the seizure world, there's something mystic about seizure and losing 
the vital force. For men, it is the oil, the semen. And for women, it's the same thing. Sexuality don't work good when people have seizure. It's like you have a difficulty to just stop. Because it's an electrical problem. And since you need, since you need the, the, the Christ, what I'm called Christus, or the Zeros, which is the Isle, the Christ, they actually call it Jesus. But true, there was no J in the language. And 600 years ago, they put J in it. It was really X. I get us Christus, which is Y. But it's actually, it, what it basically means is Isle. When they would say, anoint me with oil, my cup run it over. He was actually talking about the brain. But he told them to give them esoteric knowledge there. We look on it practical or physical. And so sex, when you have in seizure, tremor, shaking, any nervous disorder, the electrical impulse is out of kilter. So you don't really want to tamper sexuality because you don't want to connect to nothing we're not sure about. You want to detach from certain things. I'm Bill. So, vervine is a good spiritual plant. As a matter of fact, there's a story. This is just a story because I, I never story my belief. But let me say there's a story that when Jesus was on the cross, it was the vervine tea, vervine herbs they used, bought him. I would say it's a story, but the relevance esoteric wise to it is that because the brain is a whole network of nerves that is what i pick from it and many more people pick the same thing vervine they are showing you indirectly that vervine magnify the central nervous system the peripheral autonomic um the gang lions which is the whole network of your nerves vervine do a great job up there so use that one for your, um, your seizure and just don't eat the negative food it can help you greatly. I don't know if there's a really a correct way because Irish marsh people boil it. I basically don't put any um, icing, what I'm call it, um, flaxseed is good. But the next one I'm use, them have something else. Well, them put, you don't need that. If you just put a piece of cantaloupe, not cantaloupe, um, papaya or banana or jackfruit to it, it's good. But don't override it with nothing because you want it to do its work. You can make smoothies or porridge or tea. Just like we would have made banana porridge or the same thing. You just don't put no sugar in there and no, no spice up, no wulipa wulipa away because you want it to work. The idea is to have Irish marsh, not additives. Well, take away. You know, but you can magnify it. It by itself is 92 minerals. You know, if you're looking sweet, ripe banana, jackfruit, papaya, those good. And don't make it sweet, that's you taste it before you taste the Irish marsh. Yes, that makes sense. So, um, the vervine and the rum goat dash along. It's for the nerves. Circulatory problem is the bird duck and the yellow duck. Sassy pearl and the bassy the bark. You just put them together and boil them strong. Take two cups per day. That's like an iron tonic. Bird duck, yellow duck, um, sassy pearl, bassy the bark. All four plants. Put them together and boil them. And you need three cups per day. The rum goat dash along a vervine is for the nerves. Three cups per day. You can take them on different different days. This battery are full. I can't plug them out. something for your gut of gas and it a roll get the cascara bark for that purpose maybe you have gastroparesis get the cascara bark 
gastroparesis, gastroenteritis, gastritis. Cascara hmm. uh, bark. Get the cascara bark like 70 grams and you take a tablespoon, put it in your pot of the cascara bark. Two cups of water and boil it to one cup. Drink one cup in the morning and one before bed. That will help you with a good problem. Bless up yourself, bless up yourself. Mm -hmm. I need a new phone pen and all the one I get trouble. Mm -hmm. Numbness in the finger, or your carpal um, tunnel syndrome, or what you call goit, or your belly. So, what you can do is get the cascara back, clean up the belly, or the belly. Any farm and numbness, always there. So. And if it's stiff, or it's, can, it's straight and can come in, or it's stiff and can go out, always the belly. Get the cascara back, clean up your belly, and drink up the sassy perla. Good, like three cups per day. Yes, those can help. You can also, um, Basida bark is another good plant. Maybe you're losing sinuvia fuel. So, Basida bark of the gel that works perfect. You want a spinal cord. Anyway, you bend up, bend up, bend up, giants, bend up, bend up, like your foot, your knee cup, your ankle, your toes, them, your blood overall, because I put that gel back in and you become like a baby again the basida bark of a procyanidin which is like a high-tech antioxidant move inflammatory problems bless up yourself you know you bought a bottle of fruit from the eye of stomach burning root which one You bought a bottle of root from then. I have smoke burning. What kind of root you buy? Let me know. Flowers. Let me know what kind of um, herbs don't give you smoke burning still. No plants give you burning. You must be amalgamating it. But if you buy something from somebody which is herbs, that's not what give a burning. You have to have the knowledge of what is a plant. Herbs can give a burn unless it, like when you drink something hot that different and it burning, but it cannot give you like stomach burning because it's a plant. God never designed it that type of way to burn. It move inflammatory things. What happened to some of us in reality what I experienced with some people, some people not saying that you are lying. But not the plant. You just don't have the knowledge of what gives you the burning. But some people, when I'm taking herbs, and we say, don't eat this, don't eat that. But we, we know that kind of art still. Because yeah, I'm bad for your picnic. If somebody just come and tell you, say, stop eat that, it's hard. Because I had that problem for years. I tried to come off of um, brown straw fish, and escovitch fish, and it's hard. Steam fish, curry fish, it's hard. Not really hard, but the habit wholly already. We have to fight, 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 fight. It's a fight for get rid of it. You know, so when you are eat at 45 or 25 or 50 at a good one, and you are going to take people say, don't eat that. You, you eat it. But if you ask them, they say, no, I'm me not me not trouble eating none at all. But I don't lie to my tell. Because I know when people are telling you, know. maybe that's sensory perception. Somebody will call me. I may listen to them voice keenly. I may listen to them all and them ask me a question. I may ask them a question. I may actually make them tell me what they may want to tell me. Yes. Why? Because you're attentive. And you pay attention. And when you're inclined to, to sickness, you hear it in a people's voice. What they want to hide. So we can ask them a question indirectly. And then give you the correct answer. So you know, but you, that only happen when you rise up your, 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 your brain power or your intellectual abilities to connect, to hidden things. Some people ask me, oh, you know that? 
Of course, we can feel it. Say you won't hide it, but it is best to tell me. <laughs> we can only do that when up here is rising and you start eating good and you disconnect yourself from connection that is not positive for your force. Yes? So, what if you buy a root, unless somebody send you a tonic with sugar and uh, some more bridges you know, make roots, then put steel butter, I don't mean, I mean, you know what that is. I mean, you know, then put molasses and sugar in it, which is not good. And steel butter, man, some other stuff. If you buy that, maybe that. But if it's just a raw formula with those herbs, it won't give burning. It may be what it tampered with. Clots in your lungs was it was an um warfarin tablet that ain't good bitter wood you can get one of my quassia tea you can get the uh, lungs yes you can get try them two teas you can buy three of my products the 90c one the animal and the quassia Clear the lungs pipe and um, feed right. Go on the Irish marsh, go on the fruits. You see, I have to change the way you eat once you have this lungs problem because you're not going to have no oxygen. You can buy a few things from me. When you have blood clots in your lungs, that's the oxygen zone that send hemoglobin blood around your body to go pass through your heart. When the blood goes up in the heart, some go to the right, some go to the left, and within like a 15 second range, it coming back around. If it stopped, that is what lungs problem you can't breathe right. Short of breath. That no good. <laughs> so you can get some of my products, um, blessings, and um, clear up that. Or you can go try to find the bitter wood and drink it. Yes? Ernia is feces. So drink the cascara back and visit the bathroom. At least three times at the bathroom per day. That can remove the ernia. A blessing, you know. Much respect, man. Vervine for your oyster stomach. And you can greater the drink the vervine tea three cups per day. You can also greater the native coconut. And squeeze out the juice, not blend. Grate tight and squeeze out the juice and feed upon it. Herbs for a kidney, chamber bitters, one, vervine, two, hydrangea, three, and also shema maca, four. Chamber bitters, kidney plants, chamber bitters, vervine, hydrangea, and also shema maca. Um, tuna or tuna just whatsapp me I will give you those details we're not a price writer so and a good business ethics so just whatsapp me pile is, is constipation get the cascara back and visit the bathroom 3 to 4 times per day if you get to that You're using verba and sour sap, banana leaf for stomach. I'm on the right track. I don't know if you have to tell me something or asking me a question. Let me know what is it you're trying to convey. daughter is three years old and she have a constipation problem what are you giving to her well take her off of the dumpling and the white rice 
the dairy products and the oily food. That's a baby. Well, get the cascara back. Get the cascara back. And boil it. Get 70 grams of the cascara back. Boil it. One tablespoon of the herb. Two cup of hot water and boil it to a cup. That's the cascara back. And give her a teaspoon. Just a teaspoon. If it says vomit up the coal, we should go to the pretty much fast. Just a teaspoon. Alright? And Tony, yeah, get to her. But the things them take care of for the last cup and the Ice cream and the oily food, the dumpling, rice. I don't know if I do that yet still. Bread and the snacks. And one thing I can tell you about snacks. Snacks constipate people, you know. Yes, them snacks are only going to spend 2000 3000 I will tell you this, Anthony. Give her a whole lot of fruit juice. And you can mush the fruits. Do not give her no more snacks. No cure your ball feet no garret because you're gonna spend money till thy kingdom come. If you want broke and pauperizing, feed the pitney around. You sick your wife, sick your pitney sick. Everybody I got a doctor. You can't save the money. Sometimes I have money for do something good. Boop sickness come in. I said, John, you want. And yes, but tell your doctor, we are gonna do. If you want to stay broke, feed the pitney around. From no one, give her only fruit juice. Crush the fruits, them. Mush them and feed her with it. After you give her the cascara bar. The, the, the teaspoon will break it up. But don't make sure you eat too much out of the pot. Our digestive system, the peristalsis, is not powerful to chop up the food like we eat. It's young, she's only three years old. And the body doesn't power up until she turns 12. It's. At age 12, she maybe start menstruate. That is when her eggs them come alive in her body. 11, 12, somewhere up there. So I think in a boy pitney, it come 12 or 13. I think at the same place, the woman them get eggs too. When the eggs them come, that means the body in a developed zone. The peristalsis then get powerful. The constriction them get powerful. Them can work. At this age, no. That constipation will kill her slowly but surely. It will start rotting up and mess up the internal body before she even reaches away. Take her for them. Take her out of the supermarket, brother. Take her out. Even if the mother costs, don't get her. May I tell you? You're going to spend money till the last kid don't come. Pitney to enough people in the papa, you know. Because they want to, they want because they don't broke them bad. If they want, daddy, they want this. No, eh, no, eh, no. You get to look at your backside too and shut up. <laughs> if you don't do that, eh, eh. This me can't tell what opinion. Then turn on papa and turn on your blood pressure. Lord Jesus Christ, me tired for tired. Me don't know if you know. Mm -hmm. But are you a grow them? <laughs> Why is it you can't roll your own pitney in your yard? If me can't roll my pitney in my yard, me don't want to mean it. I'm going to come out. Any age will be left. I don't mean, want to put it there. No, sir. If I go to put it there, I can't talk. And you say, yo, don't do that. You know? And you go back chat me and be up face and like how you appear rent and I find food and I pay shit. I'm throw you out, man. Yeah, man. I'm going to roll that, man. I'm going to play them game there. Yeah, man. When my put them the sick and I get them very bad. And I'm going to say, daddy, I'm going to just put my strap over my shoulder. You know? You want your man to say, but that it is nice. <laughs> it better nice. Come in now, go back to the hospital out there. You know, you know I'm one of the things with the hospital for your catch. You don't play them the game, the man. If you want broke, feed people around. The hospital full. You see what that children in the hospital, 2,000, 2,500 people in a line. Mm -hmm. I want to feed them wrong. I said they can't go to have sense. That's why they disrespect so easy. And that is why they don't pay no mind neither. You say, can I go to the water? Come give me. 
Then you must have come, come and come out of Mommy, may I come? No, nah, move a rotted muscle. You better wait. Whereas, if you have arthritis, say I put you better see me now with that. Because you feed them wrong. Them not going to respect you. Me so sound now, yeah, but that's the truth. I love have people who know them experience them problem there. Bless up, bless up, Elijah. Power of God. Amen. Yeah, man, a blessing, you know. You have you leave the music. No, you can't leave the music. Music is part of the healing also. Yeah, man, can't leave the music. Pile, as I say, is constipation. Kaskarabak will eat that. Calcium is Irish marsh. Kamu Kamu, Irish marsh. But Irish marsh have more calcium, more than Kamu Kamu. Lily of the Valley is good for your eyes. Lily of the Valley. But eye problem always starting in your gut. Get the cascara and clean up your gut. Lily of the Valley is a good art, medicine, and also bugle weed. If the art are race, palpitation, uh, arrhythmia, yes, get Lily of the Valley, it will calm it. Or bugle weed. Alright? It was sour. The oil you have it if it's sour. You know if you make it sour. When you buy it, it may be not taste what you want. But drink it. You know, for wait till it's sour. And now I'm going to sour is basically for a plant, it's ferment. Unless it's a tonic or sweet and going, because sometimes, as I said, the man didn't put something in the sweet. If you sweeten it as a preservative, because sugar is a preservative. But now I'm going to put molasses. I don't know if that you buy still, but if it's just a raw plant, our plants make a formula, most likely it's fermentation. Cayenne pepper is good if, if you can find the real cayenne pepper. If you can find it. Oh God. Oh, do not mash up. If you can find the real cayenne pepper, it's good. Be careful now. That will burn your stomach. Tiny dosage. Tiny, 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 tiny. What does Basida Bark look like? Google it. Write in Mutamba Bark. And you will see it. Mutamba. M U T A M. Mutam B A. M U T A M B A. Mutamba. M U T A M B A. Write in Mutamba and you will see what it looks like. Well, the word, the word, the word alkaline. It's a word that is need to understand. Good. So if I say all plants is alkaline, I am not sure. The alkalinity of many various and variations. Because in the biological world of drugs, you hear that some things are alkaline. What I would say about all plants, they are spiritual. The ones that was created by the most high. Plants don't have acid, but if you study biology, biology, then we tell you that plants have acid. But if, if we're looking at the word acid as something that burns, no. Depends upon what you take the plant for or if it overdoses itself. That's a different thing. But it necessarily means that because you overdose itself and you burn up yourself, that means that the plant fat become acid. And that's how it works. So, plants is spiritual and plant have a what you call pH balance. I mean it rise from 7 to 14. Plants don't have the pH from 7 to 0. Guys, not something that kill you. It enhances your life. Plants is a living force just like me. It have lungs, mouth, eyes, everything just like me. It's the same thing. They're actually 
humans in another farm just here to make sure our life run good. That's why all time people just say, plant of yeah and yes, which they do. Yeah, we were talking about the Eustachian problem. It's a damage of the exocrine system. That is what we were showing our small products them for. Yes, you can what's supposed to get something, Dennis? Dennis Dennis. Um okay, it will the Eustachian problems. Night night. Oh, you drink um, root before. Well, as we said, we don't know what in there. So, but we know the plants itself is not something that's sour. No. But we don't know what in all the root where you buy. A good body clean, bossy the bark is good, but you know, good body clean takes months, four, five, six months to clean up the body. Most human beings fully healed in three years. And that healing procedure is based upon cleaning the body of mucus. Put some simple plants and start a eating and make it that eating simple and become eridim. Hypnotic eridim, which become a repetition. Also, spiritual entity, water fast, like jelly water, a one day jelly water fast, or a two day or a three day fast, just to reach right here, you're trying to reach heaven, you know, because you want to be eternal. When you take herbs, clean out the mucus and stop eating the garbage food, once and for all, feed upon the sun kitchen food, which is fruits, Irish marsh, fast, one day, two day, three day. Um, I did a dry fast one time. Rough. No food, no water. It was rough, but we got through it for one day. Dry fast. Oh God. But it turned up your brain. Um, and I tell nobody to do it. Also, you fast, you pray, you stay spiritually, exercise, take enough sunlight, enough fresh air. And you do that for three years. Just eat right for three years. And the body will. 360 degree turnaround, you're actually even looking youthful again. You know, it's a journey where most people want to start. If you really want to live, this is if people want to live and steal from sickness. You want to gain control of you. That's people that really use, use you. Or people are going to say, Why didn't I have time for that? God, I'm going to work. Well, you can work and do it. Right here is where you want for it because this is the mind. If they say be master of mind rather than mastered by mind. If you can master your mind, it will master you. And trust me, the serpent that is in man have two purposes. Always depend upon what you feed him with. Whether through words or through deeds or food. So your action will determine how you feed a serpent. Now you can use a serpent for your will. You can use him as a protective mechanism. Also, uh, you can use him to do wrongs. In the business where you use him for. He just did it for serve you. Bad thoughts, negative thoughts. You want to chop up somebody. You want to beat up somebody. You want to cuss out somebody. So you have to feed the negative part of the serpent. The serpent is like a coil on your spinal cord. You notice them in a you know, the medical world, they have this long rod and this one snake on it with two head. So the idea about them, there is the, the good part, the almighty part that you can boost. Your body is the temple of God. 
so god no eat chicken uh, chicken back or cow foot or cow skin or hog steel him no eat them something there that him having one food him create it fruits I, I feel food that that because of that him prescribed and since you are a god and a goddess God, your body is a temple of God, so God lives in you. The body is a shell, but it owes that spirit, which is the breath, circular breathing. And so when I want to shout a breath, I'm a life force actually a move. All lungs disease is that your life force is moving out. You don't want God left your body. That's why the Almighty said, My spirit shall not always dwell with man because man has become corrupted. If you're so in flesh, you reap corruption. And that is what basically people sow in. And we eat so much meat. And we sow in the flesh. So that is why the decomposition, decomposing dead flesh sit down right here. You, it's, and it corrupted. If you look, it breed up pus and fungus in your belly. And from that breed parasite. And then the life force that was never supposed to be in you. So cleaning the body. We can tell us to take the herbs where you have to eat right. You have to live right. You know, and your eyes. Not just say you clean out some mucus out of your body and feel good, and that's it. There's an extension, and that is something we have to go to. You know, we like to explain these things to people. That's the matter of thorough knowledge of what we are saying and how it really works. What about business? What about your business? I mean, uh, um, is it Cheryl or Cheryl? I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> what kind of business? You have to make me know. Cascara bark good for your belly cleanse. Bless up yourself. Yeah, hey man. Bless up, bless up, bless up. Yeah, give me some likes. What the likes? Them likes. Them stop coming. Give me some likes, no man. Give me some likes. And we ask you to follow the host. Please follow the host. And watch all of them video up there. Even when we're not up on live, go up there and watch them enough. We'll put fuel in the belly that looks like a pregnant Mitch. Fuel, you mean wastewater. Get the cascara back. Go to the bar to move the wind. Get dandelion root. The Jamaican version. And the fine one and drink it a lot to move wastewater. Also, vervine. Boil the vervine, make the tea and make it cool and drink three cups. Not hot, drink it cool. It will make your pee pee a lot because it will work on the kidneys and the bladder. Yes, you're not supposed to look like you're pregnant if you're not pregnant. But get the, the vervine tea drink. Get the dandelion root. You can buy it at the health food store. Make tea and drink. Get the cascara bark. Boil it strong. Two cups per day. One in the morning. One in the evening. That them that can help you. And I pray that you will eat right. Since that is what put you in the situation. Oh, that is what you're drinking for your Ulster. Well, I don't know of that combination, but there's there's so many ways to do this thing. Once you get in the result, plants is just good. I just give you my perspective of how I use them and them work for me. But there's really millions of other ways to use them. If they work, it's all good. You just want to know if discomfort is coming down. That's, that is what you want. Yes. Um, I don't know if you are, you are some look clean, but why would say most Rastana look clean? Looks are very deceiving, you know. Remember that. Yes, looks are very deceiving. What you can see with the physical eyes is only what is in front of you. There's another eye inside. Try to activate it. Don't look on the outer. 
I always look from inside. If you're a Christian, yet as Christus says, if you were blind, you would be seen. But to you say you can't see you're actually blind. What he was actually saying, you must look with your pioneer gland that project itself through these two eyes. So if you're the blind, you will have to learn obviously from internal, if you move to your house. Make sense? His Majesty say, look from within rather than look from without. So most Rasta them here may be raggedy. And maybe them now dress up because they are not a part of how people see them as uh, sharp and clean. Those are the ones that were like the bingy man. You know, the, the dancer, the rasta, musician rasta, them after them look. You see them look. Yeah, but outside of that, they are um, bingy man, them. Yeah. A man on them locks, maybe tick boss, and it gone up in the sky. And him that. But there's a saying that says, My children that know me and love me, when they shall rise in the city of Babylon, they shall be of no beauty that one should desire them. <laughs> Listen to that saying. They shall be of no beauty that one should, des should desire them. So in the rest of the world, just to clarify, let you get some understanding of what, how the world are run. The Rasta man is not a clean shave man, one. And he not carry himself in a one way if he been desired by society. And it's comforting, so-called comforting looks or shape or features. In the artistic world, it is what you call artistic image. You have to have this image. Yes. But when they shall rise, when the Rasta shall rise up in the city of Babylon, they shall be of no beauty that one shall desire them. That's why a nice six at girl couldn't look on a Rasta when you're going to play the sky and want him. Because he not look good to her. Because she's only seen with her physical eyes. But if you could have looked in her heart, the Bible says the Almighty judge the heart of man. When his majesty came to Jamaica, him tell the dignitary say him want to walk and par with the rest of man them. The whole world bowed down to this man's foot. Any country going in millions upon millions of people have come out to see him. Guys are optimal, magnified, powerful human being. But yet the scum of the earth to a Jamaica would have looked down upon the rest of man them. I am on them par. When Queen Elizabeth and the body has come here, no, them disappear. So just let you understand, that's the way him choose to look. Because when this world reject him, the Almighty receive him. It is actually the liberty, not the looks. A madman will come to you dirty and stink, but yet you have no home be. You can shun him and run him. But those who are Christian, remember it says, I was hungry, you did not feed me. I was naked, you did not clothe me. I was incarcerated, you never come to look for me. I was sick, you never helped me. They asked the question, when did we do this to you? So the least you do to one of my children, you do it unto me. It goes to show you that in this world, the society that we live, if you do not come to the standard of the present look of how you should carry yourself, you've been looked down on. I carry myself like this sometimes, and sometimes if you see me, I look raggedy. Even in public. Yes. <laughs> Head not tight, locks out, so one up, so one down, so two. Yes. We look like that all the one every time. And next time a man was clean in that sense or society would perceive it to be.
so it is what I found out is not the look is the heart the mind when you sit down to talk to them one of them raggedy one day majority of them show you so much love and the way they respect you the woman them high tech them have, the woman them on this pedestal them now box kick now cause you if there's a disruption or dispute I says yes princess I, I princess everything good man I I and them going about in business <laughs> trust me you know so when you say um, most rest in the bad you have to take back that if you don't have a bathroom then you don't have the money to make it but tomorrow is that river to make such allegation is wrong you have to be sure of what you're saying but this is our society put stigma on the rest of the man long time there was a, there was a time fat leg in it how can fat leg live in a man they were dead fat leg has something to bite you sting you to death you know Rastaman beard is the first law in his majesty book cleansiness is godliness you know the official a the Rastaman don't use cologne and he don't use roller because he find out and know before he even think about it that roll on the blood, it eat it. It suppress your circulatory system and give you a lump in your lymphatic system. That's what roll on does. Every roll on do that. Cologne and spray. Because everybody with flesh actually smell bad. That is why roll on and cologne come in for keep down people scent. So enough pretty people you say I walk by. Clean. Them smell bad. Awful. If them should have never put on that, I would say, what go on yourself? people actually smell bad. They do. Because you have decomposed flesh sitting down in your gut. And a rotten, and it's sent out the scent through your pores. That is why people have mouth spray to keep down bad breath because the mucus lock in them lung pipe and lock in them nasal passage and it gives them allotosis. It comes through the pores. And some people smell actually raw. As a matter of fact, when you eat chicken, that's how you smell. That is why Roland and Cologne spray after coming in and mouth spray back a years, rub up something back yourself. And I need yourself. And I need yourself. Spray upon your body, upon your clothes, spray for people. Smell good. But then you smell good. That the cologne smells so good. The cologne is a killer. It damages circulatory system and lymphatic system. Trust me, it does. So, to say the rest of man no bad is like yeah box me and keep me down because I know the opposite. I mean they run all of the one they want to so called and look good every day. Me and them they all both them not enough and them lacks gone so and one gone run so and one come so and they may have on him him African uh, shirt. Yeah me just wear anything can I'm closing on uh, me. <laughs> you understand me? So, um, busy or buzzy, we have to take back that. Don't disrespect the rest of the man. Just go near one of them and talk to one of them before you actually lick him down like that. You know, because when you do that, I may hurt also. You have to me clean, but you hurt me at the same time. It's like a double edged sword. You have no part of your mind there. Because when you talk about one Rastaman, bad, I'm here to talk about. Now, Rastaman, I didn't me learn from you know, them same one they want to look clean. You know. I did make me be the person. Because if I'm in a Rasta role, if maybe would have dead, I may kill people. Because I never have certain tolerance for certain things. And that is why his majesty send me around them for have tolerance. And them say, no, humble youth, I'm humble man, humble easy man. You have to go to work, slow down. I no man I'm also the king on. I mean I say, eh, yeah. I must stay around them for years. Still they around them and then calm down my spirit. Teach me a lot of things about his imperial majesty. I'm learning to calm, pray, me meditate. At them make them stop, stop eat fish and curry chicken. You know? At them tell me say, no man, you have to leave them things that bring you. The eye not supposed to eat fresh eye eye. No eye. The eye eat like the bird. 
them teach me them things there. Me I said, we are same. Say, yeah, man, the eye belly got too big. Wish me belly did the water so 42 inch gut. <laughs> Could I hardly breathe? Me have this pain here. It's a shorter breath. My oxygen now left from my lungs to my mitochondria, none at all. Me have all the toes, stinking breath. Because my sinusitis was so high. The mucus had dropped off of me. me Pymate and dormate and I drop to my knees I pass it. Mess up my ears, the one here. Pain me for years. I when I travel if me ever go up on the wing of the plane. Oh God, some pain juke me off it. Remember one time I left New York, I come to Jamaica, and when I reach out to center my sweet plane landing now. One piece of bad road up in the sky up there, so come like a big turbulence. Me have to jump out of the seat, you know. And jump and force one woman out in and them run come down and say, What are you doing? I said, the pain, the pain, the pain. Listen, the man. Cold in there, you know. Cold, me know what pain feel like. And me eat wrong. I rasta man, tell me, say, no eye. The eye no feet, eat them food, the man. The eye have to let go the flesh. I eat too much flesh, rasta. Youth, them call it ample. Ample, let go the flesh. I, I, let go the flesh. I say, eh, me let go the flesh. And them tell us, you have no fruits, bingy. Eat like the bird. Them no rich, them poor. And they never make choice to rich neither. Them never really care. Them tell us the earth are your bed. <laughs> them say the earth are the eye bed, you know. Yes, I. Humbleness, humbleness, man. Humility, man. Tranquility, like that. And learn enough of them qualities. I mean, it's not. I don't mean, come from Yasa, where I'm there. come from far and come. Actually, a woman I follow come here. But it was for a purpose. I know my left, but I still there. But the rest of them keep me tranquil. And from that now, I magnify my life. I go study, research. Mm -hmm. So, don't box them down and drop them. Up, up, what do you call it? Um, what do you call it? Um, me call it outright disrespect to the Rasta man. And remember this. It's not every man who wear locks. is a Rasta, you know. Because we have all about wolf in sheep clothing. Trust me, daughter. All about wolf in sheep clothing. Love everybody, the good and the bad. Because if the Almighty was like us, we did have a long time. With him not come like us. He give every man time to turn around to them good self. If you choose not, then it is your loss. Patient and tolerance. There is no perfect being on this planet, but we are striving to be perfect. Because this is what I really want to reach. The knowledge to dare begins many places from most experience and knowledge. Yes? So... I can say I'm a Catholic, I'm a Rastaman, I'm a Christian, I'm a Muslim, I'm a Buddhist, I'm a Hindu, I am everything. You know why? Anywhere goodness is, me did it. So me not no enemy in the earth. No. Me and the Buddhist talk, me and the Catholic talk, I remember stigma upon everybody religion. You know? Especially Christianity puts stigma upon everybody religion. Christianity. The modern Christianity, which is the fake one, puts stigma as only Jesus Christ alone matter to them. Nothing else no matter. Because they read the Bible from a Western English point of view. And that is how they get it. That's how I grew up. Until the Almighty made me travel across the globe and learn these things from many other forces of religion. I realized the left people make them worship. God is the ultimate judge. His Majesty said, Let every man worship according to how he feels because worshiping is personal. If you know much damage, deceptiveness, lies, is told to you in this western world of oh God. If you know much damage them do to minds, people are walk with information and them and then have it, them swallow hook line and sink and say this is religious. It can't change. 
And the day I hear a man saying eat green hockey, and I said, that's not good. And I tell him, you know, we are chat about you can't tell me nothing. Whoop, lock my mouth. Rip hockey is a hybrid food that come here. Hockey and selfish is to murder. That's why they turn it in a national dish. Because they want people to feed. That's why it's poison people. When we learn, the only reason I can sit down here son, and talk to people for the whole night until 10 more years straight on the top is because we turn things around to find out the truth. I want to find enough of the truth. God, we say we don't know everything, but we know a few things. I want to find out the few things there, not just from Jamaica, Japan. America, England, the Caribbean, Africa, Europe. You put pieces and pieces together. How them see things? How them see the Bible in Japan is totally opposite to our seat. Totally opposite to our China seat. Totally opposite to our Europe seat. Totally opposite, 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 opposite to our Africa seat. It's the opposite. But we see it in a totally different way because we hold on to life from a English point of view and an English mindset, just like in this country, propaganda has been spread on the rest of the man. Yes. Why? Because if they never spread the propaganda on the rest of the man, too much people would have lived spiritual. And they wanted to find a way to root that out. So them paint it negative and people swallow it. Ukraine sinker. I trust me. When they say the meek shall inherit the earth, people say meek inherit which earth. When I when I say wealth you know, inherit, you go get it. It means that you the humble person will be ruling over. The so called rich and the brutalizer because that power will be handed down unto them people who serve the living Almighty in a loving and respectful manner, a fearful manner of the Most High. So you follow the laws, the ordinances, and the creed that was set from the beginning of time when creation has come in. Those knowledge has been hidden. That's why everybody does. Wicked, evil. Them now deal with life. But yet the Bible says, For the wages of sin is death, and the gift of God is eternal life. It's just that people don't know for us to eternal. And that's why every church are going out and preach, Boy, I go God hell, I go God hell, I go God hell. If you don't take Jesus Christ and baptize in the name, Lord Jesus Christ, I go God hell. Who tell you that? And which part hell really there? You understand me? So, it is knowledge that paved the way to life. You have to have a right version of it. Yes. Never use abusive words, not even to the madman of the road. It is you who is saying it. Every time you talk and say something negative towards someone else, them three trillion cells think you are talking about yourself. That's why Moses said to Pharaoh, be careful of what you're saying because out of your own mouth can commit your own judgment. That is why it's not good to curse someone. It is not good to use brutal words to hurt people because I use Satan. I use Satan. And when you talk, I you are say what you are saying. Your mouth is a commoter. So you automatically are going to hurt yourself. Worse if it's something that you practice. Just to let ones and ones know, up powerful words is in the beginning was the word and the word was with God and the word was God ye are hard gods so when you use a word when it left this mouth it must be comforting it must be powerful it must be loving and caring to next, the next being if me get up in a, a dialogue with someone I'm realizing it's going to turn out sour 
me stop the conversation. You know why? Because I don't want to say nothing for the person to feel bad. So I leave the conversation. A man can say, see, I run my run. Yes, I go run. Because I don't want to say nothing for hurt him. But you're not supposed to do it. That is how it is supposed to be because you attack the things them. You, know. you say the word and the word become flesh and dwell with you. Remember, you know, people talk things into being. Let the word of I mouth and the annotation of your heart be acceptable in the most high sight. When you speak something out of your mouth, remember you are saying what you are saying. The person we say to can be hurt by what you said, but automatically a conscience is going to dip on you. If you're not a conscience, that means you're not a judge. You dip on your own. And when people are left on their own, if the Almighty move from them, they're left to the element and the destruction of this world. For some of the worst and then you come, because if you're wicked, I shall send a wicked ruler over you. So if it words them brutal to one of God's children, remember, said those words are going to cast you. They going to come right back to you in some way. It not be by words. It can be by actions from somebody, especially the person that you may love and care about. Those are the reality. That is why English word has been changed. The, the, the reality of the English word, word, which is a broken language, the terminology and the interpretation of them that was perfect become wrong. Like weekends and weekdays, not strong in, because you can't strong in, so it's supposed to stay strong. Weak, you're weak. You pronounce it the same way, but according to the grammar, them say it's spelled different. Double E E K, double E A K. What's the difference? Is weak. Just like morning, mortgage, and morning is the same thing. What does these things mean? The same debt. Them just say debt and debt. The same thing. That is why these words was used to cast you down. Because they know that you would figure things out for yourself. So it's important to rise a standard of life constantly. You're not going to get it one time, but stage by stage, stage by stage, you keep on rising till you reach and you can claim victory for yourself. And we are saying this, these things generally to everybody that is here, to let them know, especially among us, the African people are the people of the world. We are, we are our own bring down masters. We are quick to bring down our own kind before we try to bring down any other race. Actually, we love other race more than our own. We build internecine strife or an enmity among men to cause chaos and destruction in our community. Can arise. Then because of that, what we store negative, it gets sour in our system. It creates chaos in our circulatory system and the blood gets dark because it loses the electrons and it loses also what I'm called the erythrocyte that gives the blood its color. So you start a spot upon your body and lesion. People don't know how powerful this verse. You talk something so often, they become a habitual practice. Can't move and it darkens your blood. If you read the Bible, it should say if you get too angry, it gives you hypertension. Words are spell. It gives you so much sickness. That's why you have some people who don't talk often unless when they must say something positive. Otherwise than that, they stay silent. Words is spell. They are super powerful. They can seek you and make you be good. That is why I always say, if you ain't got nothing good to say, say nothing. <laughs> no, we love everybody. Remember me telling you, 
even the madman them come to me. You know. I'll then halfway through I'm say this already. The man naked. I call me Rasta man, Rasta man. I say, why are your clothes? He say, no, I don't clothes. So I say, what you want? He want something for it. I will give him some money and he walk off. Remember just saying, I was naked. And he never clothed me. I'm mad, man. No matter about you naked, you know. But I don't no clothes to give him some, I give him some food money. At least I do something. You understand me? I never scan him and run him away. Because Jago asked me, so what am to the madman came up? When he come to you, why this man run him away? And it's a reason why I come to you. I have to find something for game. Make my record stay clean in heaven. In the book of Enoch that they took out of the Bible, says, Angels make records of our daily activity on this planet. Just like how Babylon put satellite in the sky for watch you, and they watch you now. Morning, evening, and night, they watch you. If I drink, if me, like when I rasta, I say, I don't drink, eat cold beef or drink milk. If I make mistake and drink some cold milk, the master so, so say I drink milk and then put it on the record and Babylon do that. Put it on the record and say, he's not living up because we saw him drinking cow's milk. How him see that? Him in my house? Yes. Go and Google and look on Google Earths. You can drop anybody else on your phone right now. Google Earths have that. Imagine if Google Earths gave that. What do I say? Everything you do in your house, then see and hear. They might watch you and God to watch them and watch me. So, Enoch said, angels make a record of everything that you do in heard in all generations that you come, it's been recorded. Now, I don't know about my past generation, God, that remember the move, but I know about now. And when we find out all this really around, we try our best. We're not perfect, but we try our best to come close to it because that you want. Be ye perfect as the Father who is in heaven. That's what the Bible said. So, we want to come out of the negative, as Bob Marley said, positive vibration. Yeah. If you get up on your quarrel every day, you're saying prayers to the devil, I say. Why not help one another anyway? Make it much easier, a little bit easier. If you want to put all those herbs together, you can. Bitter wood, dandelion, rice bitters. You can do that. No problem in doing that. So, Princess, see one rasta man with him, ragged deer, and approach him one day and talk to him. He ain't no animal, just talk to him. Yes, you just never know what might happen. It might make him feel good so a nice, beautiful woman like you go up to a man look like that. He might just make him dear. And that is really what we want to do. Make someone feel good. Nice. <laughs> you know, you know, you know, when um people call me at the home to give consultation to them family. And sometimes when we don't talk and they come out and you know, we are blessed boy, Dr. King make me feel so good. Man, my family, you know, you know what you do. I feel so good in my heart. That's them seeming at this reverence. Me have to sometimes remember saying, no, me is a mortal man. Say, yeah, man, but boy, I just say no come, man, because boy, I turn my head. You know, sometimes some people say, tell some things to me. me I say, what them people are thinking of their mind when they say them things? Yeah. But is is the is the comfort from within that come out to them and hit them? Make them just have to say what them say. You know, I remember one day I give a virgin some money for give her iron blow. I'm called back and say, Come here, that can't buy no. All I win one, give him this. And then give the man it. And the man says something to him, but me in the side of the man. He come back to me and say, Boy, the man said something boy I came up, but me don't understand. Me said, what him say? Him say, the man said, boy, the man that walk with seven man heart. Me said, eh, what that could I really mean? Oh, compassion. Compassion. That's what he's saying, that we feel the pain and the anguish of other people. You cannot heal if you're not carrying the load. 
you have to you only heal and feel the way you have to feel pain of people you have to feel people bitterness you have to feel them 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 anguish them docileness you have to feel that and when you feel that you have to know man I don't like the feeling of me I feel I could try to correct this some way then they are might get the inspiration now as an outlet physically say do this chemo for them I saw it going on and you heal for your man say a man I walk with seven man heart seven man heart exact number which is the high spiritual number it's like a God quality and when you enter someone province or them domain you feel good them feel good so you come come look for them some of them I wonder if you are going to come I say yeah man you have come forward man you know and you sit down and you talk to them and give them even more than what they think they should get and them feel nice sometimes just the words them start to heal them you know I talked to a daughter one night and she called me about somebody who have HIV but the guy never want to he never so tolerant and we attack me and the daughter attack and the daughter said I feel like I'm getting healed right now I say yes let the words of thy mouth and the annotation of thy heart be acceptable in the sight if your words is acceptable to the almighty you do great things if you're looking at the book of Deuteronomy him say if your ways please me then I will open the treasures of heaven if you're looking at Deuteronomy 28 and read it, it has two laws. One is a curse and one is a blessing. It goes as far to say you shall entrap a wife and another man shall lie with her. All of the money will get born, no fix. Your ways just not please God. So every time you get a woman and another man will go sleep with her. Because your ways not please him. But if your ways please him, no man can give up on you. No man can look for your wife. Can your ways please the Almighty? No man can take your woman from you. If your ways please the Almighty, no man can take away your woman. May I tell you, the book of Deuteronomy show you the blessings and show you all the curses where I go take away you. When, when my bishop friend, Christian Jesus Christ, bishop friend, called me and said, Read it, Bingy. Read it, Rasta man. Yeah, I love you, new. I'm going to read it. I said, I said, I said, That's why the man didn't take away all of my girl from me. <laughs> me say, oh, right. It. So that's why me I lose my woman then because my ways not please the Almighty. Me say, damn right. I saw you go. If you want to keep a man, your ways have to please God. If you want to keep your man, your ways have to please the Almighty. And he will make what I feel tan with you. A man shall entrap a wife. He never say. A woman shall entrap a man. The Bible says a man shall entrap married a wife. And a next man shall lay with her. Your ways, because your ways don't please him. Now, any man who are for perfect, I say for them now. Because at that, if you strive to, much hours to die, you know, from, I want to come at 5.30 or 6.30. No, I think I, I think I six. I think that's six. So, saying all of this to say that, the more outlet of passion, love, affection, you push out the, the, the frequency, energy, vibration, telepathic power there, we're good. Not G-O-O-D, G-U-D. So you could have said G-O-D. God, good. He good. And we put out, and we're going to come back. That is how it's supposed to be. Love must cover the earth. And everybody in their surrounding must always feel good about it. Three quarter must be. If 5% left, no worry about it. But people, when a man asks about yourself, you know, a bingy word or so, I'm saying, you hear about this? I say, yeah, man. Yeah, man. Yeah, yeah, say, man. You're the good man. You're not supposed to hear, say, oh, the boy there. Yes, yeah, one and two wicked we say. Mm -hmm. Because that's a finite thing. But you must live so good that others see your works and glorify in the Father who is in heaven. I remember where you put out and where you get back. 
you can plant orange and our mango for come it just na go work it na go work vervine tea make tea you spend You spend 11 nights sit up and bench for your son and from that you don't play. And now, and now go to kind of hospital. I don't wrong you. I never spend so much. I spend one, not even the full night. Don't go to the hospital and from that I don't want to go back to go back to the So any man who want to drink my verbal and they are beaten. Herbs that can use to whiten your teeth. I don't even know if the teeth was supposed to be fully white with most people around them. All the teeth is a representation of chalk. You know. Yeah. But what you want the teeth to do is to firm. You want calcium fluoride. That is why we create the intellect capsule. It makes the teeth them strong. The intellect capsule, you can buy one. It makes the teeth them very strong and it clean the nerves. We don't have any other name for cascara bark. Once you go to the health food store, just ask them for cascara bark. When it's not a Jamaican plant that I know of, it's a foreign one. Drink Lily of the Valley for your eyes and take, you can buy this formula from me. The intellect is a is a eye food, ear food, and calcium overall. Yes, very is tea. And for the lady who was talking about the rest of the man, what we were saying, don't feel hurt. We're just clarifying a few things, make you get a little understanding. We cannot blame you for what you say, because we know what the evil has done. We know what the evil has done to people's mind. So just to clarify, to make you understand that love is the art of the day. Now feel no way what I say, but just make sure they understand that when you use words, it is you, especially when you write it. The pen, your finger, send signal, write, at whatever you do. The thinking thoughts are super powerful, so change some of the narratives. Okay, you know, I just love what Dias are giving and nothing else. Proportion for Lily of the Valley for the uh, tea. Teaspoon is good. Teaspoon is good. Bless up yourself. Bless up yourself. Greetings. I need a new pen. This is a good pen, but it I get messed up now. It's a good pen because the radiation to use with the hand constant will eventually damage. Let's say you, you tap your phone with your, um, your right hand, it will damage this side of your brain. If you use both of them, both sides will get damaged. So this pen is a phone pen. By right, it have a little thing right here. So the battery is dead now, but this little... Um, switch right here so you press it and it turn blue and you use the pine to write I me use the tap because it, it no charge but me drop it so often it start mash up so I forgot to buy another one that way you don't know the the um, radiation I get for lick you I buy it because when I usually tap I feel it in my head that is why the intellect was created also the intellect up and whole of research to find out what chisel out radiation or find out the sea plants that is why we prescribe Irish moss so often we take a couple plants and create the intellect and get a perfect blend 
And trust me, it helped me a great deal. Trust me. So I would intrigue people to get these things to use on them phones since we live on phones so often. Trust me. Vervine pro prevent um, the prostate issues also. Guinean weed prevent it also. Cascara bark also. Guys, if you not clean the gut, you not get the work good. What if there's something spiritual wrong with other your stomach for a female who how can you help? Spiritual spiritual wrong with other. Um, the question um, what if there is something spiritual wrong with other your stomach for a female? Well the word spiritual let's put it into context the word spirit mean breath the word spiritual it mean the heart of breathing that is basically a breath your life force inside circle around your body people put the context spiritually to mean dump it upon somebody or somebody hobby or somebody but these words have meaning that has never been studied because a stigma went on to them to say that it can be when I say people catch in a spirit, the part of both still not understand. Because spirit means breathing. The art spirituality means the art of breathing. That is the correct meaning of the word breath. God create man and then put the breath of life in a this Ashelia. A hit make you live. So if somebody dead then I have that life that again. Then can't do nobody alive. Nothing. Man play games with the dead, yes. You know, living man play games with the body. But it has no control or power over you. You have again control of right here. Your mind. And that's why most people now have control over their mind because superstition comes into being now I'm not saying that evil is not around that's not what I'm saying it is but when the word spirituality is being used you have to understand the context and where you put it in a, to get the understanding knowledge is power fear is what man give to man and man become fear because of superstition people sometimes what usually even happen to me, fear so much, I don't want to shut up, frighten you. <laughs> I don't want to shut up, frighten you. So, we want to put ourselves in the place when we say spiritual sickness, we know exactly what we're talking about. That is why the Bible said, give your sons herbs for all generations to preclude the demons from entering into your body. Because the demons can enter in your body through food, not spiritually. Because the demons don't have any spiritual power. They don't. Before you go to bed, prayer is important to all of negative thinking and negative thought. And don't eat before you go to bed. I would say to anybody who thinks that, um, Dump it the pandemic. Or somebody, if somebody throws something like a drink, that now have nothing to do with spirituality. Somebody does a try pies and you kill you. That different. Somebody puts something like a food, somebody does a try kill you. Like when people just say, um, somebody drops something at them doorway and then wake up and see white powder, it can be a fear factor for send a signal in their mind for control the limbic system through fear. When I say it might not be destructive. Yes, but what I would say, drink herbs, clean up your belly, clean up your system, clean it up. Take your mind, control your own mind. Anytime you have three or four people in your head, them don't mean you're not good. Whereas the matter is, why I think you should have a guy who be a man because I hope you don't be a No, I not say it's evil not there, it's there and it's enough. But if we could again control our mind, it wouldn't be so powerful against us. 
is because fear is the biggest thing in the world. Fear is what people use to control people. Generation upon generation, fear is what they put down. And that is why you're being fed the way you're fed because it takes away the control mechanism of your mind, making it a control of your brain. And we have fear. Panic. Next thing we spread is superstition and propaganda. Information is spread wild like a wildfire or the wind. Drink herbs to preclude the demons from entering the body. The demons come through your food. That's what the book of Jubilee said in the 6th and the 10th chapter. And you can read Leviticus 11 verse 17. And you will see too. The moment you start eat flesh. You have what they call them sasa spirit. That is the animal spirit will trap in your body. Once you eat flesh, the spirit which from the from the animal trap in your body. The animal go through a trauma just before it dead. And you eat it. So the animal spirit always left. The Akan people, which is the Ghanaian people, always teach people that. So be careful how you eat. That's why them say be careful of what you say. Because your words, because you have demons, not dead people, you know, demons different from people who are dead. That's a whole opposite thing. Demons are the evil force who inhabit this planet, who slave people mind. That's a different thing from someone who are dead. <laughs> you know, and so they find ways and means to enter your domain through your food, especially, and your lifestyle. If you have a certain behavior, a certain habits, it's more easier for them come to you. That's why people ask, "Boy, you're sad, man. You're sad." So people ask, "Boy, how be you be No, in life we live, our appearance life we live, and the type of behavior and the type of liberty. If you get up and cuss, cuss, cuss in the yard. Bet your bottom that and something I got. The weakest link I got to get hurt, whether the baby I got sick bad, or the youngest child, or any weak vessel in the family, I will get damaged. Somebody might dead or just mash up or some accident or something. Because the devil will have his due. You have to pay for everything we do. If you live whole and spiritual, nice in your family, you've been elevated, you rise. But if you live negative, cause fight, quarrel, you keep on going down, lower and lower and lower and lower. That is just reality. It's the chemistry of life. Whatever you harness, it will come. So drink enough herbs. Drink enough herbs. The wall of negative spirit, Guinean weed is always good. Especially when you drink it green. Boil it and drink it green. But see, the bark is another powerful plant. When I talk about run dopey. These are spiritual plants. If you take Basida bark, while wool it, will big pot, and you bear the night when it's cold from head to toe. These plants water off this spirit. Guinean weed does the same thing, but you have to drink the Guinean weed. Them good. Yes? So, don't have the narrative that they're somebody who's dead, I'm going to haunt you. But what we know, when someone's dead, in our family, burn up all of them belongings. Don't keep nothing for them in the house. Them mattress, them clothes, them shoes. Take them out and burn them. That's them not surround the energy because I remember when a person dead, them spiritual energy is still there. Up to three days. But if you keep it, you yeah, are born, mama dead, daddy dead. Three days like you want to kick them, them gone. In physical form, gone, they move into somewhere else. You have to let them go. Burn up them belongings. That's the move on. Burn up them shoes, burn up all of them clothes, throw up the mattress, burn up everything for them and let them go. Because you can't make them I stay with you just for them three days. And it's not good. After three days, that's it for them. Done. Drink the herbs, them. Any form of spiritual, so called spiritual sickness. And eat right. Don't forget to have nail fungus. Stop using acrylic. All chemicals stop putting upon your body. 
you can get the neem, boil the neem and soak it in your finger. The neem liquid is good for that purpose. What kind of mango? I live in? Okay. No, ma'am, just a check. What are the foods that give you diabetes? All of the ones we use them from a child. The cooked ones. All of them. Rice, flour, bread, biscuit, bun, cheese, you know, all your milk product, bulla, your snacks, cheese chips, you know, name them. Name them. You just, you just, just name the food them where you know from picnic days. All of them are diabetic food. And every other sickness known to man. A blessing, you know. A blessing, man. <laughs> All right, Bingy. Yeah, man, let's say go. Yes, the all of the knowledge will come around now. The Rasta man is the first man in Jamaica that was talking about plants. He was, a, as a matter of fact, at my age now, as a child, we grew up with my parents. They ain't really got no doctor still. I never grew up with say, um, No, my father, they got a doctor for sure, yes. When when they were about 10, I see my go doctor. Mm. I think when my mother about 20 and she did start with doctor. But at, at, a, at a, um, pretty much a young age, in my 20s, at a Rasta man, I say, I talk about, and people can't tell before that, my always I say, I'm Kalalo. I say, yo, eat the eye lalo, man. And I say, yeah, man, I forget the dreadnought, which is the coconut. You know, I say, I tell, man, I tell. You know, so they were actually preaching about the plants um from a long time yeah man well give thanks give thanks you know yeah man the eye relax and listen while i go on you haven't used the road and from since you change your eating habit. You don't eat, need to use it because the oil that are coming out of your body will decrease. I have a bridging. He is 60, I think 69 years old. He no use Roland, Cologne, and he no use soap beard. And one day I said to him, so boy, I notice a Rasta man and a Rasta man. I noticed the eye now on a farmer, cologne and them say, I said, no, no, I have no far eye, no, I, I don't eat use them things. Then I said, why not? It must be because I not eat flesh. I said, how oh, long? I said, well, 65 years now I don't eat flesh, you know. Last time I ate fish, I won the eye did a four, okay. So four, I said, yeah, man, my, my, my sister to get, get the, most of the cabbage back then when we eat cabbage and and she did um me did have the fish and I tell her I said give me a swap. I did that eat some of the fish and I said, give me give me the, the cabbage and you take the, the fish. And I said, so long I said, yeah man, I not touch no flesh from that. So I said, that's why the eye know. See what I say, I I see it. Yes, I. So if the flesh sit on your belly, it can't digest. So it's only like a rotten. Maroon, well, let's put it say the Africans in worldwide, everybody will come from the motherland. I more or less speak for the conscience of the world. 
white, Chinese, name the races then. Because at the end of the day, we are all humans on this planet. We want to find a common ground where we can agree. Those who don't want to find the bonding and the union will get root out. Simple as that. You know. So, we could put it worldwide when we come together in the human family. That until the philosophy which owes on receipt superior and another inferior is finally and permanently discredited and abandoned. Until the basic human rights are equally guaranteed to all without regards to race. Until the color of a man's skin is of no more significant than the color of his eyes. <laughs> so, you have to look upon that in a one way. Until there are no more first class and second class citizens of any nations. And so when you look upon that speech, 1930 in Geneva Conferences, Imperial Majesty make. Although the last part said, we Africans will fight if necessary and we know we shall win in the victory of good over evil. But he was speaking for the conscience of the world incorporating all races until the color of a man's skin is not significant and the color of his eyes because you know someone have blue eyes and someone have green eyes someone have white eyes someone have black eyes someone have brown eyes and red eyes until the color of a man's skin so if you, if you look on that you now you want to bring the world not just say brown people, black people like us, but everybody, everybody, as in your book it says, everyone is welcome, all who find righteousness, even the Gentiles, if them find the law of the Almighty, they are welcome, yes. Not every man that carried it, the year is a raster man. All right, we die. We die. The Aki and the Salfish is a Jamaican staple, which is too poison food. The Spaniard them carried come here. Aki. Aki is a hybrid food. That's why enough people poison them. It's a man made food. It, the earth accept it because all them set it up a couple thousand years ago the earth accept, accept it all them set it up but it's a man-made food just like um, cashew is another man-made food but these foods are eat because we don't really have the knowledge that they're not good over 400 years of programming and more and still continuing you know still continuing Yes, on the top, um, on the uh, top of the screen. Yes, a full time and now nine o'clock. We die along. Yes, tap the screen, man, and put in some likes. And we ask you to follow the host, follow the host, follow the host, follow the host, and share the life, whatever it is. Yes, follow it. You love the vibration and the wisdom, a blessing, you know. It come from the Most High. I am just the vessel who transmitted this word. As the great book say, remember, it is not you who is speaking. It is I who is speaking through you. <laughs> yes, that's it, go. You have learned so much. Just know more than I learned all of my schooling. Well, give thanks the I come to the university to learn about the words, you know. That's why in school they give you spelling words to spell, aka casting a spell. That's it. Spell. You're spelling yourself. When you say you feel weak, you're going weak. You know, you say, weekend man. <laughs> in the week. So we never say in the week as Rasta man say, aye, you know the strong enough. You know? Yeah man, him nah use the word weak. <laughs> him not say bad, him say goody. 
<laughs> because he realized long time, he realized long time, say something wrong with Babylon Word. Yeah, something wrong with Babylon Word, you know. That's why I'm shot in him vocabulary. I, 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 in reality, the first word in the alphabetic alphabet is I. That's the first letter in the Bible so far. In, I, in. That's why we say I and I. Yeah. You know, it make relevance, you know, to enough things what we learn. A dick is a belly problem. Or they may be sinusitis. So get the cascara bar, clean up your belly. And get Lily of the Valley and drink as a tea. Liver spot, rice bitters is good for liver spot. Rice bitters. Blessed Tissel, prickly poppy. You're talking the, the one with the yellow flowers. It's good, perfect. It work on your, on your brain. It work in your blood. That's a good plant, you know. It's a good plant. Some people call it blessed tissel. But it's good for fever and also flu. Good for also virus. It I use it. I use it. I use it. I use it in the digestive system cleanse. My 90C1. I use it. Very powerful plant. That's another a powerful plant for lungs. For lungs, they call it spiritual plant. Because it works and your long spike. We call the prickly puppy to have a B maca and one yellow flowers. Very powerful plant. Them plant, you know, everybody just drink them plant. They don't have to have no special sickness because them water have sickness. That's the duty. Yeah, the pen, the pen I give away and all the pen I mash up. Mm-hmm. This plant This plant is a raster plant and you know it is a ice green and gold. Look good. Red, yellow and green. It's a raster plant. <laughs> it good for your liver. Good for your colon, good for your blood, good for your limb, good for your brain, good for your skin. A very good plant. So now you learn. And you can just write it in. Um, prickly puppy. And you look on the literature of it. And you will see some of the goodies that it does. Men never meet a raster man I teach Bible better than my Sunday school teacher. <laughs> hey. You know, we grew up in a church, you know. But when me did that look for me never really find it in there. But when you come and learn about his imperial majesty, he said the Bible is a rallying point, it's a compass and a direction. However, tamper they may tamper with it, the truth will remain one and the same. But the Bible was written in Greece, then come to Amaric, then to Greek, then to Latin, then to English, which is the last translation. Now, the words I'm using there, if you get them the terminology in um, English, you wanna get. Just like when Bob Marley said, got to have Kaya now. And so it has been said, which is Ganja, it's Kaya. Kaya. Which we name a little girl the other day, Kaya. But Kaya mean life. It means moving away from sickness. And the word kaya is in the Bible. The word kaya then in the Bible. 
but you wouldn't see say mean ganja but ganja marijuana is life it have changes and simplify a different chemical for your body so when you look upon the word kaya is a life entity word you don't see that in your english language that's why a man says you smoke, smoke ganja but you don't smoke ganja you smoke life you drink life that's what it means kaya so if you look at the definition from always an English perspective, you're going to get what you want from it. That's going to give you the real truth. But if you go into your Bible and you get what you call a lexicon concordance. Because the Bible never written in English. You know, it was only translated in English. So when you see a word, you actually want to know what the word means. You put it in your lexicon concordance. If you go from the Hebraic, the Hebrew perspective of the Bible, and you see a word, it have a number beside it, and you click the number, it carry through the lexicon concordance and show the origin of the word. That is why it's good when you say the twenty-third Psalms in Hebrew. I think that was the language that it was said in Yahweh Spatai Tiktak Ufia Gitilatega. Yahweh wrote in the exar din out deshi yar big sayne al mei mini coaching a lane in nafshi shivanian kene be maglit sidi klima anshmo gam ki elect the gates al mabit lo ira ra ki ata imadi shit kamosh antika amayu na kamone trap levanai shol kandget saradi shanta ba shemen roshi kosi uvaya. October kissed the early phone, the cool make a yai, the shot to defeat Yahweh, the Oric, Yamin. That is the 23rd Psalms in Hebrew. The moment you start to say it in that language, it's in resonance right as in your brain and over your brain. If you're going out on a normal day, you want your life and your day to be good, you say, Elaya kaya oa nafshi ela hai ba kaba takti aliat suwa vaile kumaya oa via futsu via ka deni sumsene yaka me pane yaka. When you said them three prayers there, and you said the last one kumaya oa, you say three times. Rise the bar, one this level, one this level, and one this level. You protect any environment you in now. Right, this one. protect that environment. Right, this one. Because it start magnify your spirit and put a guard or a shield over your body. If there's negative thing you say, Yahweh wrote Elo XR to ward off that or kick a fukuhulu. So one is American, one is Hebrew. It is good that the African man learns Swahili, Yoruba. Hebrew, Akan, any African language because it have a resonance or you chat patwa and speak less English. We use the English language to convey what we want to say because that is what people understand. I'm not saying I know Hebrew to any white skill. I don't. But we chat patwa which is Hebrew and American, Akan and every other language in Africa, so on a normal day when we are chat to people, so we are going, we are dealing with, we are come from that is Hebrew, right there. It is Swahili, it is Yoruba, it is Amharic, it is Geese, it is also French and German and Japanese and Chinese. Patois is in every language, that is why when you sing it, everybody loves the song because they can relate to it through their culture, also. That is how powerful the Jamaican African man is. If you're looking at the Bible, you will see those who go by the eyes must sing unto us a new song, a song of redemption. Eyes, not a continent. Reggae music band. And everybody loves Patwa. Trust me. It's a beautiful music. Great night. What you use the herb is up for cleansing. It's a brain food and a total body cleanse. 
when you drink it so often. We have it in tea farm. First time listening, welcome. You want to talk to you, how can I? Okay, you can book a consultation. The person want to, Randall, Ronald, yeah, you book a consultation for any lengthy conversation, you have to book a consultation for one hour. And we have a lengthy conversation. 354-7875-354-7875-354-7875. Lupus is a dangerous sickness. Them butterfly fly all over your body internally. Basi the bark is a good herbs. Basi the bark is good for lupus. Um, this boy is strong and drink three cups per day. Uh, so you can drink um, rice bitters tea. Coconut water, always good. Um, so basi the bark one, rice bitter tea good, bitter wood. We have those herbs, so we don't know if you want buy them tea the front way. Yes, you can get them tea there, and we can advise you on a few more things to use. <coughs> and you have to eat right. Lupus or something will damage the calcium level of your body because it damages the blood. So automatically you will have heart problems and circulatory system issues. So your bitter wood is good. Rice bitters is good. Um, Basida bark is good. You want to get the cascara bark to clean the belly, Brenda. No, the Brenda. Um, Sandy, but no, I see the name is too good. But those are the plants you want to get. All right, allergies, stinging nettle is good, bitter wood is good, rice bitters is good for the allergy. And look at the ice cream cake and the dairy brenda. Basi the bark for the blood, vervine is a good blood cleanser. Um, the same bitter wood is another perfect blood cleanser. Did you know that people with HIV? And sometimes we may talk about the plants, but you wanna go down and so much of the literature of the plant and man may not get it. People with HIV, you see. When them have HIV and you give them bitter wood for the first time. Because it have um it have potassium sulfate in it. Which is a skin food, and it have calcium chloride, which is a, a hard food, and it have a little bit of sulfur. When you give them it for the first time, people have HIV. It come like it pass the disease, you know? literally slow down the amalgamation of the disease, you know? Because you know, so when you have HIV, <clears throat> it going to the immune system and create like it create a, 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 a friendship with the immune system and then it override it and then it creates cytokine storms and kill so much cells guys a murderous disease when they drink the bitter wood in the biological world of the medical field let me tell you that it have been um <clears throat> quercetin which is a virus chemical because bitter wood heal malaria you know but it also killed colonies of lava in your blood. People have elephantitis is a very good plant to use. Like another plant them call Asplendus nidus. We call it cotong. It's a fern or growing a tree. Hepatitis, big foot, swell up foot. Cotong plant is good. Like people have swollen foot and foot fat. Cotong. We call it nidus. Is a fern that grew in the tree. Bitter wood have that benefit also. So bitter wood is a powerful plant for your blood. 
and bassy the bark. Trust me. You use them and eat right, you will get some nice sweet bonus benefit. Liver spot is rice bitters. <laughs> the person asked the question about 10 times. Yeah, my rice bitters is good for your liver spot. Greetings, greetings, everyone. King of the forest is a blood plant also and a liver plant, I should think. Not the greatest liver plant, but it's good. Um, it's move corrosion out of your body. Yes. So it's a good plant. You just drink them plant. They're very good. The number is 354-7875. 354-7875. Is it in Canada, Ontario? I don't know which one of the plant is talking, Julie. Text me and find out which one. If Cascara back, yes, it's there. Anything for menopause? Menopause, rum goat dashalang is good. And um, sassy perla. Weight loss, Cascara bark and bladder rock. Let me see it again. You must see the, um, the prickly puppy. That's the only plant I've shown since night, so I must see the attack. Prickly puppy, man. Maca plant. Good plant. Them plant, you drink them at night, though. You drink it a day. Menopause. Yes. Sassy Perla good, rum good, dashalang good. Um, cascara bark for the weight and bladder rock. Scala. <laughs> uh, more blessing. I am listening to you real talk. Yeah, man. Originally, me is a East man, you know. Me is a East man, but me just dug in at the, uh, the South Coast, yes. But me is a East man. Yeah, man. First time, well, welcome. Well, we give thanks that you're getting some enlightenment or highlighting. Yeah, that is what the most I say we have to do so we know I'm violating you know, we have to just work with the floor. You know, guy, you don't know. Pinch nerves is a belly problem. Get the cascara bag to clean the belly. And you get the vervine and the ramgut dash along. Three cups of tea per day. Laxity for kids, cascara bag. That's tiny dosage. Let's say it's a three-year-old or a two-year-old. Actually, I remember more than one. One was four year old and one was two year old. And them couldn't defecate. And we give them the 90 C1, a teaspoon. And Lord, belly rose up. The only problem the parents them had was too, en too much energy from the children. Them. So you can get the, um, the cascara back, or you can buy one buckler with 90 C. And you just. Um, teaspoon the family can drink it you know and once the child free up please take them off of the snacks eat them on the food all the fruits black support is a good food you know it's an excellent fruit it's a total body food in terms of mineral content long time you don't get none but it's very good black, very 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 good in terms of our laxative benefit, it neutralizes any form of um, <coughs> infection internal. <coughs> I think we answered the liver spot more than five times, you know. So I don't know if the person is here. It was a rice bitters is good for it. Anything for a woman who have had a baby, um, I don't fully understand, but Nettle tea is good as a brain, heart, blood, and limp. 
um, Basida bark is also good for clean out and wanted or you could say leftover particles from having the child. In other words, when you have a child, a cleaning out is supposed to take place in the womb. Basi the bag does that work and also vervine. Just in the form of impurities like blood may left over that's supposed to come out. I remember now no, them coming out of the maternal pool. Pure blood. So they, they, before it reaches postpartum, the basi the bag is good too. And you drink the vervine tea also for clean out. Then you use the nettle tea, drink the nettle tea if it magnify the brain, keep the brain protected. But as I tell you all the while, the nettle tea having choline, that is good for the child. So when you, when you have breastfeed, the, 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 the choline, we you drink from the nettle tea, I go, go to the breast and keep the lymph nodes them in the breast under control. That's them to get contaminated. So you have to protect yourself and the child by drinking stinging nettle tea, what we call it couch. Next good thing to eat also to refine the system is the Irish mash. It's good. <laughs> is the earth flat? I don't know, I never study the earth, but I should think so. We know it's round. You know, but I should think so. I should think it flat, but I don't prove. That is one thing we say. First thing as we come on the platform, we do not know everything. We don't know the whole pass up. Just a little thing we know. Just a little few things. What we use over the years, and that suffice. The nerves burning, get the vervine and the rambo dashalam. And the basi, the bark, is a neutralizer for all inflammatory behavior. The isocom, which is Irish for herbalist. Oh, <laughs> yeah, for calm in this, in this work, yeah, man. Uh, Wolpa tolerance. Vervine, Rambo, Dashalang, per, um, Pauline for the nerves. Yeah, man, you have it around a country. Around a country, something them there, you know. Um, just send me a WhatsApp for the, for the prices of the product. 354 What is used for autism? You treat you all all saying one word. Hold on. Mm. Vervine is good. It's a nurse food. Communication and it have dopamine in it. Stinging nettle is also another brain food, very powerful. Also, sarsa perla is a good plant when you drink it so long, it keep the brain young. We know for a fact that when you give a child a stinging nettle from an early age and you keep them up, keep them on it up to nine months, so let's say you go six months then. What I experienced with a lady. Um, she had her son who was supposed to do that exam with the pit in them get. And she has said him now nah, study and she had worry. But in him they have a better problem. So I tell her I said, give him this thing in little tea for drink. Three times per day. But she couldn't get to give him three times. Now they go to school. So she gave him a tea in the morning. And when he come from school, she gave him the other one more cup. And she did worry herself, or worry herself, so boy, boy, now go pass the exam for go high school. And the boy go high school, and the boy keep on telling mother, I say, Mommy, I worry yourself too much, man. Me, all right, me know, me remember something them. And in go high school, I pass the test. When she called me and asked me, so, Oh, this possible? I said, The nettle tea, what you give him? Yeah, give him, yeah, give him the nettle tea for nearly about four months. In memory, go come around because the memory not start to ruin. A child, a boy child, have sperms in their body at age 12. And if you make him watch porn, he may lose the chemistry, the communication, the signaling, and the memory, and the nerves, and the electrons once he starts masturbating. Because once the life force comes, it comes to magnify your whole entire body. 
if you make him watch porn and masturbate to destroy the faculty of mind. At 11, it no reach in him. At 10, it no reach in him. At 9, it no reach in him. All of that young youth foliage, powerful. If you feed that with herb food, no, you have to have about three. Feed that boy with nettle tea and sassy pearl. Don't take him a fight. I'm very fine. So you give him one, you give him sassy pearl in the morning. Let's say, how old is Three years more. So you give him like, um, like a quarter of a cup. We don't have a cup bottom. Make him drink that. As him tea, sassy pearl, right there, so. You have build him nerves, you have build him electrons, him, 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 um, him steroid, him testosterone. All right. Then you give him the nettle tea. Give him a cup of nettle tea at midday. Give him a cup of nettle tea at midday. Right up, say, 5 o'clock, 6 o'clock, you give him a half cup of verified. Guys, him nerves, I go get relaxed when you go in bed. Sassy perlot, nettle, vervine. If you wake up in the night, give him another cup of nettle tea. And what you can do, turn around, per day. Give him one cup of sassy perla three times for the day. So one cup in a three quarters. Morning, midday, evening. Next day, nettle. Give him three cups of nettle tea, morning, afternoon, evening. Next day, fervine. Give him quarter of a cup. So put the one cup in a three quarter for the day. The only one we are going to give him a full cup is the nettle. And watch him bring. Turn around. Turn around. But please, don't give him the last cup. Lord, man. And will put fry food and highly food. No feed him for them something. No feed him for enough fruits. You don't want him to turn full. So, autism is not basically like a killing thing, you know. It's just that the neurons them active and overactive. And so it can deplete. So, the words in vocabulary low because the learning skill impaired. Of the, the neurons them out of kilter. So them three plants, a sassy pearl, a stinging nettle, a vervain can balance it. So nettle tea is three cups per day. Whenever time you give him that the day that three cups, sassy pearl is one cup, split in three parts. Vervain is one cup, split in three parts. And within a couple months, you are going to see things that turn around. But please, feed him right. Raw moon is a steroid plant. But it's also what they call um is a gynecologist type of plant. Not much from the perspective of a gynecologist, meaning people who study it. It's a plant to deal with a female system and also male reproductive system in terms of estrogen and uh, um, and for man. Steroid is a blood plant, cleanse the blood, but also clean the reproductive system and the digestive tract. So it's a good plant. Pour up the body. Irish marsh is great. All right, we're there now for a long time. Um, fibride, Guinean root, vervine, dark blood. Same thing for getting pregnant. Put them three plants there. Guinean dark blood vervine, Guinean dark blood vervine, a handful of each, five liters of water, and boil it down to two and a half liters, and drink two cups per day. Those can help. Gallstone, you need bead bacca leaf, then call it chamber bitters, chamber bitters, gallstone, chamber bitters. Also, another one they call hydrangea, hydrangea. So you can use the guinea, as we say, um, vervine and dark blood. Use that for your pregnancy level. But you can't pregnant time, gallstone, you know. You have to be careful. 
Bacida bark for the blood circulation and the, and the pregnancy. Create new blood cells. Yes. Well, give thanks, you know. No, don't mix them, man. Remember, remember what I said for you, don't mix them up. Artism, don't mix them up. Remember now, how different one it is. If I the person with the little boy, remember now, vervine, sarsaparilla, stinging nettle, a three different day that, you know. Sarsaparilla, one cup, split in a tree. So a three times, remember to drink that till it's done for the day. Next day, stinging nettle, one cup, three, three cups per day. No boss that. I need the, the, the energy in my brain. Vervine, I same thing like the sarsaparilla. Is it stinging nettle? Yes, stinging nettle, man. They call it couch too. Make it dry. When it dry, the scratch go away. Yes, you can put your dart upon it. But you have to start, you have to start giving them the condensed milk and the sugar and the last command. I mash up the pit them too quick. And the pit then go for love the sweet, sweet. And when they get things where when they sweet, they don't want to drink it. You have to determine if you have good minded pit you have to make sure the pitney drink it. Don't make the pitney bad you know. Why don't you make pitney a rule you know, nowadays? Make them drink the herbs. Start them from the herbs from now. And look what type of pitney I got. Different kekla fish in that the pitney there. When them the herbs are going at them brain. Yeah, Sassy pearl keep your brain young, you know. When you drink it so often, you make your brain young. Just like when you drink animal guinea. It come right in your time excel and make you loving, caring, and responsive. And it protect the marrow in your bone and create good source of your defense system. So the herbs them not play, I just throw them and know the literature of them. But me study them. That's why I can't tell them about them and know so them work. She can't sip or she she can't she can't sit one place and don't move. Well, that's a child. That's what they do. They busy body. But when them taps the therapy, remember, you know, it's this whole of sugar content. When I give them, you know, take them off of the sugar and off of the last cup. Take them off of the sweet, sweet. The synthetic sugar, when I give them, is killing them. But when you know so that it had it, cripple them nerves. Take them off of it. All sweet products. Only give them fruit sweet. If you want that sweet, sweet, sweet for them, give them jackfruit. Jackfruit sweet. If they want to give them good sweet, give them jackfruit and ripe banana. They can mix them together and give them it, blend them and give them it for drink. Those things are sweet. You know, but this sugar and the snacks, you're killing them. You're killing the children. That's why you ain't going to keep no money in your pocket. You know. So, feed them right and you have some good pitney. Nettle is a plant, stinging nettle. Vervine is good for insomnia. Just drink one cup every 25 minutes. Tea. Well, we give thanks now for the blessing. Lily of the Valley is good for the brain. Stinging nettle is good for the brain. Yes. It's best to be a fruitarian more than a vegan, though. We are not really herbivore. We are first fruitarian. Herbivore herbs was basically who eat a lot of vegetables more for the animals. Since herbs and vegetation, vegetable take 18 hours to digest. Foods take one or one and a half hour to three hours. So you can see the vast difference. Vegetable don't have in pectin, which is a digestive enzyme. Food does. From the moment the food enters, you don't have to chew too much. It becomes liquid content. The cell structure make energy prevail because the sugar content and the blood suck it up fast runs on liquid and since you have a chew vegetable so good refine it so you know so it's a secondary food so but they put the narrative of vegetarian which is vegetable and people first before fruit tyran you see them always turning around the thing so most people say they are vegan and they are vegetarian not fruit tyran but yet the sun provide the food you call it the sun kitchen. Give thanks. Tomorrow.
is Sunday, I should think. That's how you go. So we'll be here again tomorrow, most like at 3.30 p.m. in the evening. So bless upon yourself, and we will talk tomorrow. Come on, come on, come on.